Hello friends, in this video I am going to show you ABG test by using Abbott iStat machine and Abbott EG7 plus cartridge. Hello friends, this is Abbott iStat ABG machine and this is Abbott iStat printer for ABG machine and this is the kit EG7 plus about iStat here is the barcode having expiry date and lot number this is the kit for ABG let's have a close look The market price of this machine is approx 3.5 to 4 lakhs, very small and handy. Now I am going to test the uh, ABG test. In this machine, this is the display and this is the site in which the cartridge is loaded and in the head portion you can see this is the sensor by which it senses the printer here is the printer sensor of this printer after placing there we can print by press this button here is the heparinated blood the heparin is first draw into this syringe after that blood is collected from artery let's have a look how do i test the abg arterial blood gas this is the cartridge before twist i have to on this machine by pressing this button the machine is on you can see look at this number one large treasure number two i start cartridge we have to go number 2 i start cartridge press 2 scan or enter operator id i i have to skip this i don't want to put operator id that's why i press enter scan or enter patient id i am not giving the patient id i should skip by pressing enter scan cartridge lot number here is the cartridge and this is the lot number we have to scan this barcode by this machine let's scan this is the scan button and scan the barcode as you can see barcode is given taken barcode, barcode is taken and here in the machine insert the cartridge let's unopen the cartridge by here Make sure that after cutting, you have to place your finger in this side, not that zone. If you hold this zone, the result may vary, the result may changes. Now smoothly detach the cap of this syringe, look at this, here is the portion in which the blood I pour, in which the blood I give the blood in this portion. Have a close look. I have to give blood up to this mark. This is very crucial. As you can see. Let's insert the cartridge into this machine. Identifying cartridge, please wait. Cartridge is locked. Now it's given the time calibrating 0 to 120 second time to result. Do not remove cartridge. 
during this process don't remove the cartridge let's see what happen after 120 seconds i am going to pause the video after 120 seconds i will resume to show you the result now we can see here is the result in front of the screen you can see easily look at this ph pco2 po2 base excess bicarbonate total carbon dioxide and oxygen saturation now i have to print the result place the printer here and in front of this i have to place this machine as here is the sensor let's press the print button this one is the print button look at this the printing is done wirelessly and here is the result you can see it also gives sodium potassium ionized calcium hematocrit value and hemoglobin also as i don't given the name or id of the patient therefore it is blank here is the result have a close look look at this here one for test option if i press one it so remove the cartridge then then i slowly remove the cartridge you can see what happened i poured the blood up to this mark this blood is transferred to this way and gives the result the test is done i have to off the machine for off this machine press this button you can see the machine is off thank you for watching my friends see you soon in my next video